Hey, how's it going? Today I'll show you how to install Aptoy TV to your Fire Stick. Aptoy TV is an amazing alternative app store which you can use on your Fire Stick to download some applications which are not available in the official Amazon App Store by default. It has thousands of apps, even some games, and most importantly, all of those applications are totally free. So that's amazing for us, the users. And now let me show you the easy way to get Aptoy TV to your device. First of all, you have to get an app called Downloader to your Fire Stick. You can actually get it for free from the official Amazon App Store. Just go to search on your device, here it is, and start typing the loader in the search bar. As you can see, there was even no need to enter the whole name of the app, because the loader has already appeared at the bottom. So we click on the loader, and that's the app which we need to download to our device. However, after you get the loader, it's not over yet. We still have to set it up. And to set up the loader, we'll go to settings, so click on that button with the gear icon, then scroll down and go to My Fire TV. Open it, and here we'll have to enable developer options for your device. However, on some Fire Sticks, and especially on the new ones, the developer options can be hidden by default. So, if that's the case, do not worry, it's really easy to make them appear. Just go to About, select Fire TV Stick, and now click on the middle button on your remote for 7 times, and do it fast. So, let's do it. As you can see, now the button for me it says No Need, you are already a developer. That's in my case. In your case, it's going to say that you have become a developer now. And if you go back a bit, you will finally see developer options, which have appeared right here. So open them, make sure to enable ADB debugging, then go to install unknown apps and turn that option on for the loader. So what it does is going to allow us to install other applications from the internet and not only those which are available in the official Amazon App Store by default. And that's exactly what we're going to do right now. So now let's go to the list of apps on your device, here it is, and there is the downloader app, which we already installed and set up on our Fire Stick. However, before actually using the loader, there's one more thing which I really recommend doing. It's of course connecting to a VPN. In my case, I mostly use NordVPN, because they're super fast, we got a great application for Fire Stick, Android TVs, phones, laptops, or pretty much any other device you may use. And they're not expensive, in fact, they cost less than a cup of coffee per month, which is great pricing. In a VPN app, you just connect to any server, let's say I will connect to Cyprus right now, and from the moment we connect, all our internet traffic is going to be totally encrypted. It means nobody can track us or snoop on us online, and that's extremely important if we wish to stay out of trouble. And if you don't have a VPN yet, but you'd like to try it out, I do have a great offer for you. If you use my link, which will be in a pinned comment below the video or inscription of the video, you'll get 3 months of NordVPN totally for free, which is an amazing offer. And if you're watching this video on your TV or on your Fire Stick, then just get your phone or your computer, go to topvpnoffer.com in the web browser, and it's going to send you to the same amazing deal for NordVPN. Or just scan the QR code, which you can see on your screen right now, with the camera of your phone. It works the same way and also going to give you 3 months of NordVPN for free. So get this amazing deal, and now let's use the loader safely. So we open up the downloader application. On the left side menu, make sure to click on home, that's important. And then here you'll see such a search bar, in which we need to type Aptoid TV. So let's do it. So let's type Aptoid, then click on space and add TV. Make sure to enter it exactly as you see on your screen and then click on go. Now in a couple of moments, search results are going to open up for us. And now when the search results open, we need to scroll down a bit until we see the tv.optoid.com. That's exactly the link we're looking for because that's the official website of Optoid TV. So we click on it, and now the website of Optoid TV has opened. At this point, we just need to scroll down a little bit until we see that huge download Optoid TV button. Let's click on it, and in a couple of moments, the download is going to start for us. As you can see, that happened really fast, now just click on install right here and wait until the app gets installed to your Fire Stick. After that, do not click on open yet, instead press on done, because here we have an option to delete the installation files, as we don't really need them anymore, so don't let them clog the memory of your Fire Stick with unnecessary installation files. Click on delete and then delete once again. Now what we actually have to do is go back to settings once again, go to my Fire TV, to developer options, install unknown apps, and now we have to turn that option on for Toy TV as well. 
it's a must if we want to use Optoid TV to install other applications from the internet. Now let's finally go to the list of apps on our device. Wait until it loads, scroll down to the bottom, and here's Webtoid TV, which we just installed. Now I would recommend you to click on the Options button on your remote, that's the button of three horizontal lines. Click on it, and then press on Move to Front. This way, Aptoid TV is always going to be at the very top of your application list, and it's going to be really easy for you to access the app every time you need it. Then, of course, don't forget to keep your VPN connected to stay safe and out of trouble online. And once again, you can get three months of NordVPN totally for free if you use my link in the pinned comment below the video, or just go to topvpnoffer.com. That's my website, which is going to give you the same amazing deal for NordVPN. Then let's finally open up Toy TV, click on OK here. You have to allow access because otherwise you would not be able to download other applications. And pretty much that's it. Now just browse the application and feel free to download anything you want. Hope the video was helpful and see you next time. Bye bye.